Hola, Bertrell, you're always on time, e man. Oh, you're always on time, so good morning. How you doing? How are you doing? So, me, I didn't look tired. I'm tired, man. Let me buy gone. Afternoon, shout out. Or should I say, it's good morning, shout out. What my people, them there? Them there mix up pages. People, people, where are you guys? Oh, no one see me, no one say hello. Y'all don't want to come and say hello to me today? I have nothing to chat about you, I just come and say hello. I tell my friend now. Every day I come and have nothing to talk about until something just pop up. But that no means that I don't come and say hello. You see it? So, Bertrand, where, where are the people them? Good afternoon, boss lady. I'm okay so far. Well, you have life, you know, girl. So, thank God you're okay. Hi, Miss Rosemary. See, Miss Rosemary, Miss Lorraine Mason. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Come and say hello. It doesn't mean that we have to have things to talk about every day. We can't just come and just chit chat for three minutes. We're not, when we don't have nothing to talk about, we don't stay long, you know. Miss Inca, Miss Michelle. Hold on there, because the battery looks like it outfit. Collapse for me soon. Plug it up there. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on my way to go pick up my daughter. But it's early, but I want to get you an early spot in the line because watch it, can't park up already. I don't have time yet. Just come pick up my daughter from school. See, I can't go by the top of the school bus, they don't block me. And let me say, I come early, I'm still late. People line up. Happy Friday, guys. Happy Friday. I hope that you all are having a wonderful day today. I hope that everything that you wish for will come true. Miss Joy Gordon, good morning. How you doing, sweetheart? Yeah, double park right there, sir. So, you know what I say? Just my luck. You know what? We can go park over here, sir. So just my luck. Yeah, just my luck. Drugs free. School zone. Okay. But I don't know if you do with drugs. Miss Joy Gordon, good morning. How you doing, darling? I hope that your Friday is bright as mine, sunny and shine. People na laugh after me, you know, so I can't use my backup camera. Me can't use my backup camera backside, no sir. Alright, make a reason a little bit now. Mind the double park. Yeah, no, to a school road didn't really bother we like that, you know, drive safely safely. Thank you so much. To a school road didn't really bother we like that. But you know guys, we have life. And once we have life, we have hope. You know, things may not as bright as how we want it to be. But trust and believe that better is going to come. Thank you so much, darling. Thank you so much, Joy. Better is going to come one day. But you just have to trust and believe. You know, no matter how, how dark it seems today, trust me, there's some form of light going to come tomorrow. I must, I, 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 I'm, you know... I have confidence, like I, I am, hi Miss Pauline, how you doing darling? You know, I have a lot of confidence in myself that anything me not get done today, I will get it done tomorrow. Um, sometimes you're at a place, sometimes you're at a place and you believe that there's no hope. But trust and believe there's always hope, there's always hope. Sometimes we focus on the wrong things. Most time we focus on the wrong things. And we did not take time out to see the right thing. Sometimes the right things are staring us right there in our face. Right there in our face. But we turn a blind eye. You, you might grow up and you hear them say, you never see the nearest thing to you yet. You always see the things that far out. That's true. Take a look at your surrounding and look at the things near to you, nearest to you. And you will see what I'm talking about. I'm not in any bad mood. Since of late, I've been in some very, very good mood. I make some changes in my life. And if I had known that making these changes in my life, my life would be better, I would have made these changes long time ago. But scared, like I am scared to, to, to do this. You know, just like you might in our relationship, and you might be like, oh, I'm scared to start over. I've burned so much time already. And you know, you're just scared to start over. Sometimes it's good to start over. 
sometimes it's good to change your dressing sometimes it's good to change your eating habit and it work better for you and it might not work better for you you understand me so vice versa six or one half dozen of the other tomato tomato but it's always it's always good to make a make a change i miss laurel sweetie why Miss Laurel? I feel like I want to chat to you right now, you know, Miss Laurel. May I tell you the truth, you know. People, I go black Miss Laurel. Because Miss Laurel, Miss Laurel, there's somebody that eats some nice mango right now. And I just not feel like I want to talk to Miss Laurel because she eat the mango. Yes, my bad man, Miss Laurel, for your mango them. Yeah. And I have to make sure so I tell now because I don't want to run with the wrong thing and go say how flawless is not like Miss Laurel. My bad man, Miss Laurel. Yes, my bad man. This time for the mango there when Miss Laurel I eat. But it's all right. Miss Laurel, when I eat the mango, drink some water and call me name, please. Call me name. I said, flawless, if you if I did the close, you don't get one of the mango. But I still love you, but I'm going to block you. Until when mango season done, Miss Laurel, then we come back for you. You understand me, guys? So, so I'm saying that to say this. No matter how dark, no matter how you see like rain go fall and the time set up. Just know say after a storm there must be a calm. Don't worry yourself. Just continue to believe. Continue to pray. Continue to hold yourself up here. Don't keep yourself down here. Continue to rise. Continue to hold yourself up. Because when you tell yourself say I can do it and I will do it. I will do it. Let me tell you, nothing nothing or no man born of a woman can stop you the moment you say thank you miss laurel the moment you say i can do it and i will do it nothing or no man born of a woman can stop you because you know what you stand for always tell yourself say i can and i will Eh? or when you're broke nobody should know they should look at you and believe that you have money hi call me in good morning they should look at you and believe that you have money even when your rent is not paid for hi miss jackie hebert herbert la la hi miss jackie herbert even when your rent is not paid for nobody should be able to tell you that mm -mm. Because your landlord not tell them what you tell them for. They should not see the frown on your face and like. When me mad, my mouth get longer. Can you imagine now my mouth so long? No panic. And when me get vexed, my mouth get longer. Can you imagine that? And me a weird frown on my face till somebody go say, Flawless, what do you? Somebody says, obvious, you, you can't see me like that. And. You know, me never know say it's so obvious that you can tell that something is going on. First thing, me not have no pleasant face. I'm not a person who smile all the time. You understand me? So when, when you start wearing that frown on your face now, you tell everybody that something is wrong with you, and they wanna know. But let me tell you, 95% of the time, the person that asks you what is wrong will not and cannot help you. And even if they can help you, they will not help you. Next thing, you tell them what happened to you right now. And them run, gone with it. Them run, gone with it. Go and tell somebody else. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Thank you, Miss Birchill. Thank you, Miss, Miss Herbert. So, them run, gone with it. If they just keep that little details about what's going on with you. Look at me. But I can't tell me something I have money because this was how I, this was this is the same person you met on the internet. You never see me a wear flashy this and flashy that. Good morning, Miss Gwendolyn. You never see me a wear flashy this and flashy that. No, me broke down. You still now go look and say, wait there. They know she did have on one nice wig there and her face beat and tan good. So what happened to her today? This was the same person. That's why I'm telling her, Miss Marjorie. Good morning, sweetie. This is the same thing I told you guys. Do not live for the norm of society. Live for you. Don't put your basket where you can't reach it. Because one day, you're going to try to take it down and you're going to drop and pop your ass. And you're going to go right by your butt. 95% of the time that people who fall are people who fell. Go down on them ass. Hi, Miss Badora, sweetie darling. How you doing, honey? 95% of the time, a person who fell have to sit on their ass before they get up back. So never hang your basket where you can't reach it. 
Rachel, good morning, sweetie. How you doing? Lord Jesus, every day you come with the money, man. Now, El Amigo del Pablo. Hey, good morning. Hey, when I got TV to talk all them language, I'm done, you know. Faith Daily, good morning, sweetie. How you doing? You never change. You... Yes, so I live in the of society. I am not gonna. Hi, Miss Desna Irving, good morning. Yes, man. So, never, never see somebody with something and rush to go up there with that person sometime in life you, 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 I never feel I never feel time for reach up there so you have to take a step at a time me never see nobody I never see anybody climbing a ladder and skip out the ladder and reach up the top now then climb it one thank you for the star Miss Inca darling thank you so much you know so when you see me like this this was me all along I mean I'm gonna change you understand me? Thank you for the stars, Miss Laurel. This is me all along. I can't change, will not change, and will never change. I'm going to be, so whether I have money or not, you're not going to know. And I'm not going to come out here and start begging people. Miss Laurel, please, can you send me $20 in my cash app? No, I won't do that. Because I will never give you anything to talk about. I will never, good afternoon, Miss Amanda. I will never give anybody anything to talk about me. Never. Anything you can talk about me, you go search and find me. And let I me mean, I mean tell you. So anytime you hear flawless from the panel line, I beg nobody nothing. Something is wrong with me. Something is definitely wrong with me. Anytime me go beg, I must help more and help somebody. I'm gonna show no everything. I'm gonna tell you no straight up. I mean hardly do that. But there are times when me always try to just use my own money and help somebody. Me not come and beg nobody not to help nobody. So it kind of hard now. Even now, me can't see myself even calling even the husband we me have, even the kids that we me have, and go tell them I beg you know this. That the word beg can't come out of my mouth, period. Yeah, tell me I have too much pride, I'm full of myself. That's okay. Because what I learn about people, the moment you beg them, them feel like them fit just pass some remarks about you, or them supposed to treat you bad. Miss Cheryl, good morning, honey, how you doing? So keep on a little one stone cell. Miss Olivia, good morning. How you doing? Olivia. Good morning. You know? Keep that little thing about you to yourself. Nobody not have to know say you never eat nothing. Nobody never have to know say sugar and water you mixed your picnic last night for eat. That pride, keep it in you. Because you see, when God say do all these things, He's gonna make a way. Where there's a will, there's always a way. I don't give people weapon to use. I no. Keep those ammunition to yourself because sometimes we give them the ammunition to fire at us and then we come out contact our people at chat with no how them know that something happened in your house how them know that yeah your husband not chat yeah your wife not talk how social media people know about it social media people never have to know nothing about it but you you make them know about it you tell them Hi, honey, Miss Sherry, Miss um, Sharon. Good morning, darling. How you doing? You give them that ammunition, so they're gonna use it against you. I don't notice me not put a contact nothing about me. I mean, I have not to come prove to nobody. You know, Miss Patricia, Grandma, how you doing? You understand me? Something happened in your house. Good morning, Miss Kita. How you doing, darling? Miss Kita, whatever your name, Skeeta Davis. Whenever you sing the nice song there, eh? You don't have to tell everybody something about going to your house. You have a relationship on a breakup, keep it that way. Keep it that way. Social media don't even know about it. If they want to go find out, make them come find and talk shit about you. You don't tell them nothing. You don't come prove nothing. So I will never ever give nobody nothing to come say about me. One thing I can tell you. As I said before, bear your wants. Keep what you have in private. And if you're doing something and you believe that you want the whole world to know, go make a flyer, you know? Go make a flyer and post it up and down. People will know. You understand me? But keep your little things them to yourself. Let a person see you for who you are. Don't live for the norm of society. Do not live for the norm of... You see what's going on on social media? I came on social media this morning and I was browsing. And I'm, I've been listening to some people, like, talking. And I be like, I said, my God, flawless. I say this sound, you know? Flawless, me not put them down in a car. Flawless was right there, you know. Flawless, I say this song, and I say, my God, I can't even watch some people anymore. I can't even listen to them. I just can't. And I said to myself, this was how I was sounding 
oh my god and let me tell you something you don't have to curse those bc those rc to put a point across you don't have to curse those bc or those rc to put a point across because boy flawless me never know say i sound bad when you do it you know but yeah man when you did that with the same say so sound come and listen it disgusting it disgusting I never know. This is a BC RC. I ya slash them left, right, and center like you slice up. Not you slice up your man banana and them something. Me never know. So when me did a talk it a soy so on. So you see, because now I I I am grown. It called growth. You came a long way, my pro. Thank you so much, Miss Laurel. I feel so um you know for to hear you of all persons say that. Yes, and it's gonna be like that. Um, before I um. Before I get back to that point, I will not watch people. Disgrace. Yes. Me listen how we saw no. I mean, but me, me just come out with like when somebody mess with me. But these people are doing it every day, all because of money, all because of the little money. Come on, y'all, y'all saying that it's not because of money, but I flawless know it's because of the money. Any day, um, Facebook take with them in stream ads. And all these things, y'all are nothing. <laughs> y'all gotta go back to the drawing board. Y'all are nothing. Anytime TikTok lock down, uno and nothing. Can nobody now hire uno? Nobody now support uno. Hi, Miss Claudia Brown, darling. How you doing? Nobody not gonna support you guys. So we, I know it's because of the little change, the little change that y'all are making, driving everybody crazy. Hi, Miss La Miss Laverne, darling. How you doing? Ah, so I am just saying that to say this, guys. Be who you are. The same person you're being in private, be the same person in public. So when the chips are down and things now go your way, nobody can look by you and tell you that you're going through something. They must wonder. They must keep wondering. Wow, a how come flawless a glow so? Me not think she have money. Then how she looks so? Then she says she not work. Then how she how she not look broke down? No. Girl, me might brought down, but you can't tell because this was who you saw before. What's the topic? Can someone in another topic I've done me done right now? Anyway, guys, I am happy that you guys were here for how much minutes? I told you guys that I was gonna spend, spend a long time. Um, it's now 18 minutes since I'm here, and I was only here for three minutes. I'm gonna call you Laverne. I'm, I'm only here for three minutes. And I hope that my little message has always go a long way. Love you guys. And remember always to pray put God first in everything that you're doing and trust me he will come through for you may God bless you guys until I see you again Miss Sharon Rose you're late darling but guess what um, you come up for oh Miss Sharon oh Miss Sharon Rose good morning how you doing you come on thank you so much and I hope I will continue to make you guys but I rather to have my few little people who will tell me the truth than the ones that will sit with me in the lies if I do something wrong, I wish you guys could tell me that flawless, you're wrong. You shouldn't do that. Don't comfort me with the say. Comfort me with the truth. Comfort me. Oh, uh, wait, how you go? Comfort me with you, but not the lie. How you go? Comfort me with the truth. Something. I remember, yeah. Hi, Miss. Um, hi, Miss. Uh, Miss. Miss Andrea. Me did just come to say something, but I don't know me now. Every time I come to say hello, something always pop up. Anyway, guys, I love you guys, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.